Yeah, some days I feel unfazed Like when I'm with my friends with a cut raise hey. And on Monday, I got a gun raised Suicidal, do a dime till hump day Then I go right back at it like an automatic More drinks, more songs, more beats to rap I need a shrink, I'm gone More time keeps passing, no watch, no thoughts at all Just a hat, new era Rep my P's and those O's Need a Phillies with my orange and black to feel home From Citizens Bank back to Camden Yard To Taylor, two cities and trust we go hard Trust we go hard, yes we go hard You said we go hard, I said we go hard Rockin' my Bob Cousy, stockin' up on the loose The delivers come easy, but the life is a doozy And yes, I'm choosy, and no, I won't settle But I still take pop off over that kettle Cause I'm talking bigger picture, and yes, I'm gonna hit you with the... It's a well-known fact that some of the world's best entertainment comes out of Australia. Most of you should know that recently I made a video on Australia's greatest TV show. But believe it or not, there's even more content to come out of Australia that's just as good. If you live in Australia and you're sitting at home, bored out of your mind on a Friday night with nothing to do, there's so much more Australian content out there to watch that's just as good as Highway Patrol or RBT. If you want some quality entertainment in Australia, there's plenty to choose from. You can walk down to the local train station and watch the Human Circus. You can walk down to your local Local fast food establishment and watch some live action UFC or you can open up YouTube subscribe to my channel and watch all my videos but the topic of today's video is something that's so entertaining that it's almost as good as my videos and that is dash cam videos in my opinion there are four countries pioneering this genre of entertainment those being Russia China the USA and of course Australia you may think that watching people drive around is boring, but you're forgetting one thing. This is Australia. You see, thanks to Australia's unique roads, paired with Australia's unique drivers, it makes for some cracking entertainment. Some common sights you'll see in Australian dash cam videos are cyclist abuse, road rage, cars becoming airborne, pea platers attempting to drift, a lot of burnouts, a lot of people driving the wrong way on the freeway, a whole bunch of running red lights, and a whole bunch of crashes. This form of entertainment is just so good that I can guarantee after watching just one video, you'll be hooked. So to prove my point that Australian dash cam videos is the best source of free entertainment, I'll be taking you through some common sights that you'll see when watching these videos. First up, we have pea platers. Pea platters are arguably one of the most entertaining yet most dangerous thing you can see in Australian dash cam videos. The most common thing you'll see pea platters doing in dash cam videos is drifting, burnouts, somehow ending up on their roof, and causing general chaos. The reason pea platters are so prevalent in these dash cam videos is because the P in pea plates stands for performance. This means that pea platers have to always do over the speed limit, take corners as fast as they can, drift and do burnouts. And because a pea plate basically means that you're a qualified race driver, you can drive however you want. Now naturally, due to the fact that performance platers are always pushing the limits, there's always going to be a few accidents. But there's nothing more entertaining than watching some pea platter in a Commodore with an open diff try and drift it like it's Tokyo Drift and end up through a telephone pole. Now, while we're briefly on the topic of drifting, we'll get into the next category, and that is hoons. Now I'm just going to briefly touch on this because it's basically the same thing as pea platers and I've already done a whole video on it. Hoons take the performance driving of pea platers to the next level. You see, most pea platers you try and drift have open diffs, whereas hoons take it to the next level with a welded diff. Most dedicated hoons try and pull this sort of stuff off in a dead of night, where there's no one around and there's no one to film their antics. But of course, some of the best dash cam footage comes from people who are driving around at 3am for some reason and come across a pack of hoons in action. There's nothing better than a good tip in, which is why this is some of the best content you can see in the dash cam videos. Next up is Road Rage. Road Rage is definitely one of the most common parts of these dash cam videos and arguably one of the most entertaining as well. There's nothing funnier than seeing some fired unit jump out of his car and try and start a punch on with the person he just cut off. Road rage is a blanket term for a whole bunch of different activities. Road rage includes, but is not limited to, 
punch-ons, attempted vehicular manslaughter, tailgating, side swiping, and of course, verbal abuse. Now while I can't condone the violence, it is pretty funny to watch. And thanks to the fact that it's so common in these Australian dash cam videos, there's always a good example of road rage for us to laugh at. Now this next topic has to be one of my favourite things to see in the dash cam videos, and that is junkies. Junkies provide some of the most entertaining driving in these dash cam videos. Due to the fact that these guys have no licence and are driving a stolen car, it makes for some cracking entertainment. The brilliant, not my problem philosophy applies to these drivers, because they can ram you, cut you off, abuse you crash or do whatever the fuck they want and when they crash their stolen car into a pole it's not their problem you see junkies don't even have to be driving to be the stars of these dash cam videos but it's good to know that whenever you see a vx commodore with no plates driven by someone with no teeth something entertaining is about to go down Another extremely common thing that you'll see in these Australian dash cam videos are red light runners. There's nothing more satisfying than seeing these impatient fuckwits run a red light and get cleaned up by oncoming traffic. But by far my favourite part about the red light runners is that most of the time they do it in front of police, making for some awesome instant karma. This is the sort of thing that gets me up out of my seat screaming suck shit dickhead at the screen. Now before we get into the final and my favourite part of these dash cam videos, it's time for some honourable mentions. First up, we have Uber Eats drivers on push bikes riding over the Westgate Bridge. No matter what happens, this shit will always be hilarious. There's nothing funnier than watching some poor cunt ride a push bike over the Westgate Bridge for a $6 Macca's delivery. Next up, we have cyclists. Now as much as you may hate cyclists, I gotta admit, I feel bad for these guys. But still, I can't lie, this shit is pretty funny. Next, we have Uber slash taxi drivers. You'd think these guys would be good at driving since it's their job, but of course, that's not the case. These guys, 99.9% .9 of the time, are driving a Toyota Camry with a tissue box in the back window. And even though they drive around all day and get paid to do it, most of them are still some of Australia's worst drivers. But I have to forgive them because of all those beautiful contributions they've made to the Australian dash cam videos. And my last honourable mention is just shit that shouldn't be on the road in the first place. Things such as pit bikes, mobility scooters on the freeway, electric scooters on the freeway, and my personal favourite, the motorised picnic table. But anyway, now we've arrived at my favourite thing to see in Australian dash cam videos. And that is... Airborne cars. One thing that us Australians are really good at is managing to send cars to the gods. For some reason, us Australians are gifted with the ability to make cars fly. Now this is definitely not the most common thing you'll see in these Australian dash cam videos, but when it does happen, it's awesome. Anyway, if you enjoyed this video, make sure to like, subscribe, comment and share if you'd like to be enlightened by more teachings from the prophet of Yorak Hunt. A big shout out to Dash Cam Owners Australia on YouTube and Facebook. I'll leave a link to their channel in the description. Make sure to check them out. And a shout out to everyone who made a donation to the charity of my bank account. I've already spent it all on out of date service station sausage rolls. And if you made it this far, make sure to comment Dash Cam to let me know. And check out the website and buy some stickers, yeah dogs.